So despite the FUD, despite the negativity surrounding the SHIB ecosystem and Shibarium right now, we're actually seeing some very exciting things happen. And in fact, just the other day, we had a new record high in terms of daily transactions happen on Shibarium. 153 and a half thousand transactions, not a small amount by any stretch of the imagination. And if you compare that to some of the other layer twos in the space, it, the numbers are actually really good, guys. But I want people to realize this. This is still the early days. We have not seen the launch of these thousands of projects that are wanting to build on Shibera. We have not seen even the official DEX migrate over yet. We haven't seen the metaverse come. We haven't seen stable coins enter. We haven't seen wallets emerge yet, right? There's a lot of stuff that still has yet to come yet to come to the space, but still we are seeing these great numbers. This is a sign of actual adoption on Shibarium. Now, if this is happening right now, where times are bad in the market, nothing's really happening for lack of a better term, right? Imagine what it's going to look like when Ethereum gas fees are insanely high, when the market is booming, when businesses are wanting to integrate with more blockchains, right? Shibarium is a natural solution for that for a lot of reasons. Actually, I should have had this pulled up, but obviously it's green, it's fast, it's cheap, it's easy to integrate smart contracts, right? We know dApps are going to be coming too. There's a lot of great things that are positive for the future of the SHIB ecosystem because again, this is all built on Shibarium. There's a lot more stuff We'll call it the, the technical term, a lot more stuff that is going to be coming to the space. Now, I get, you know, I still see people talk about it all the time. Burns, 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 right? I, I get it, guys, okay? I want SHIB to be burned too. And I've given you guys the exact reason why I do, because again, it's a new use case for SHIB, can become the best store of value in the crypto space. And burns down the road is something that as a community, we should be able to change. When governance is rolled out, that's a key thing, guys. You know, I had somebody ask me that. Governance has to be rolled out before any changes can be made to the space. I want people to realize that. Yes, it, it we're technically centralized, more centralized right now because unification is in control of the chain. But when we get to this point where governance is rolled out, it becomes this decentralized ecosystem, okay? There are many things that are still coming. SHIB's not a company. We will have the influence to do with this chain what we will, but we need to make sure that we're smart about it, okay? We want adoption to come in. We want to make sure anything that we put forward is something that can actually benefit us, something that can help things continue to grow, not just remove a bunch of supply. You know, for example, if we look, I made a video about this. If we look back at some of the suggestions to remove a lot of SHIB, like the percentage of, of transactions, I think that's the dumbest idea we could do. A 1% transaction fee is the dumbest and easiest way to kill Shibarium, all right? Because guess what? Million dollar transactions, they won't happen here, all right? People simply won't do them. Who wants to spend $10,000 on a transaction fee? Nobody, all right? There are gonna be smart ways that we can do both things, that we can breed adoption and that we can burn SHIB at the same time because that's what people really want, right? People want their SHIB burned. But instead, you should just want price to go up. If if the SHIB ecosystem continues to garner adoption, SHIB is that coin that will continue to see that main adoption happen. Yes, Bone will see some great stuff happening too. By the way, Bone is 92 cents right now. I'm loving Bone at these prices, guys. But both of these can become giants in their own right. Okay? So I appreciate you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Show your support below. Let me know your thoughts. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.